In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to set up an Instagram account with Squarespace and then display those Instagram photos on your Squarespace site. So to start off, we need to connect the Instagram account to Squarespace. To do that, we're going to scroll down here to Settings, and we're going to click on this little gear icon. Then we're going to scroll down to Connected Accounts. Then we're going to come up to this top right, and we're going to click the Add button and then we're going to click on add this Instagram account. Now this is going to do something a little different for me because I've actually already had it connected um, but for you it's going to take you to an Instagram page where you're going to just have to click on the word that says authorize and then it will go ahead and connect your Squarespace and your Instagram accounts. And once you do that you'll notice that here we now have PicBuggy the Instagram account is connected to Squarespace. So now that those two are connected, we need to actually get the Instagram photos to display on the website. So to do that, we're going to go back to the Content Manager. Click the little A icon here to get back to there. And then here on the home page, I'm going to click this little plus icon to add a new block. Once I do that, I'm going to scroll down through all of these options here. And at the very bottom, you're going to see a section called Social. And here we see a little uh, option here for Instagram. So I'm going to click on the Instagram block to create that. And then it's going to ask me to choose an account. And I'm going to choose PickBuggy. And then this is one thing that is a little weird, but you're going to have to actually click on Save and then come back to it so that it'll actually retrieve the photos and you can see what you're doing as you go through the options. So I'm going to click on Save now that I've connected those. And you see here there's a little Sync Successful and it's retrieving the photos. And give it just a second. I'm going to actually, so we're getting a little glitches here, so again, Squarespace is not perfect. So instead of redoing this, I'm going to show you a way to just kind of get around this. So I'm assuming there's some sort of glitch with the syncing. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to save the page, and then I'm going to hit reload up here. And... Let's see. Oh, there we go. And now that we saved and reloaded the page, it is fixed. And this is the most recent Instagram photo on the feed. So this is something, uh, Squarespace, because you're working in a web browser, uh, there will be times where there's glitches. And the easiest thing to do if you run into a glitch is to simply save what you're doing and then refresh the page. So now that we have the Instagram account linked in up here, I'm going to double click on the Instagram block again. And I'm going to come over here to this design section. And here you actually have a handful of ways you can present this. So right now it's in a slideshow format, but we could also make it a slider, um, which slider is similar to slideshow, but you actually kind of scroll, uh, you scroll to the right and kind of go through photos that way. We can make it a grid and then you have some options here that appear um, to choose how you want that grid layout to be. Or we can stack them. And if you do stack, then they're basically vertically going to stack on top of each other. And so really, you know, there's a handful of options, but you just kind of go through and you pick your options here. And then the final parameter, which I will show you here in the grid format, is if you go back to the account settings you have the number of items to display. Right now it's limited at 10. If I want I can drag this and we can display up to 20 items if we'd like. Uh, so again just some more options that you can play with there. At the end you hit save and we have now added Instagram to our account. 
Uh, so again, that's the basic way of just getting Instagram set up and running on your Squarespace account.